I recently restyled my living room for a photo shoot we had here. The theme was 70s bohemian inspired, which was perfect as I had done a bit of thrift shopping and found some gorgeous pieces that fit perfectly with the theme. Starting with the bookcase, I've added this beautiful ivy plant. My first thrifted item is this double handled pot. I really love the tricolor finish on this one. I ended up planting a little prickly pear cacti in it. Next, I'm adding this adorable little llama planter my sister gave me. I still haven't decided what plant I actually want to plant in this yet, so if you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments down below. Moving on to the next shelf, I'm adding this orange glass vase, and next to that, I'm stacking some books. These are actually my current bullet journals, but I thought the colors worked really well with this decor. This little honeypot was another thrift find. It was made in Japan and cost only $2, such a cute decor piece. I just love the colors on this ceramic piece, especially around the handle, so, so pretty. This thrift find was only $2 and made in Korea. For the next shelf, I'm adding this little glass dome from IKEA. I've displayed this beautiful handcrafted mushroom inside. I couldn't believe it was only $2. It still had a label from the art gallery it had been displayed in. I found this adorable little terracotta pot for $1, which I planted another cacti in. This larger dome is also from Ikea. This is one of my outdoor cacti, which is another type of prickly pear. I then added this glass amber bowl, which was only $1. It has a Durex stamp, which I believe is a French glassware brand from like the 60s or 70s. You have probably seen this resin cow skull in my videos before. Unfortunately, I recently dropped it and its horns cracked off. I don't actually mind it hornless though. It actually makes it easier to fit when styling it on shelves and things like that. My last thrifted find for the bookcase is this beautiful ceramic jug. I love the reactive glaze finish down the middle. And lastly, to finish the bookcase, I added this seagrass basket from Kmart. Moving on to the bench, I'm placing down this wooden chopping board. I picked up this brown teapot for $4. I've slowly been adding more browns and neutrals to my home. I also found this clay leaf plate for $2. This is a vintage bottle my nana gave me. This is another Japanese vintage piece. It was $3 and it matches the teapot perfectly. Next, I'm adding this horse print and a ukulele. These two were also a dollar each and of course I added more cactuses to them. I then added this Polaroid camera with a few photos. To finish off, on top of the bench I added some more cactus plants and a couple of crystals. For this shelf, I added this amber glass plate, also gifted to me from my nana. And then on the other shelf, some canisters from Target.
This is by far my favorite thrifted item. I picked this chair up for $40. It's a synthetic leather and originally had a swivel bottom. I removed the swivel bottom and added wooden legs from Bunnings. I then just started with this fur cushion from H&M Home. This coffee table was another thrift find. It cost $20. It's not showing up well on camera, but the lacquer was so disgusting. There was little hairs all sealed under. It was so gross. I was originally planning to sand it back and stain it with a white stain, but once it was actually sanded back and I could see all the beautiful wood grain, I decided to go with the darker stain. To style the table, I've added this brass fruit bowl with these clay beads. I then just added a few more decor pieces. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you would like to see more. Hope you have a beautiful and creative week. Bye for now.